Hey, hi there everybody. It's Jane Hamill from Fashion Brain Academy. And today's video is from the Ask Jane segment where the designer sends in a question. So the question today is from Andy from Washington DC. And he says, Jane, could you please suggest a good place to get labels for my new line of menswear? Absolutely, I have some good sources for you. So think about this though. Um, when you're ordering labels, like a lot of things, you get a price break when you order in quantity. And the price break is sometimes so dr dramatic that we get excited and we wanna order 5,000 labels, 3,000 labels, that kind of thing. Beware of this, beware, please. Do you really want all those labels hanging around? I've seen so many times, myself included, designers um, order a lot of labels and then, depending on what happens with their line and where things go, if you're brand new, you may find that your customer ends up being a little different than you thought it would be, your niche changes a little, and you have these labels that are a certain branding and you want a different branding, okay? So my, my, my advice to you is order the minimum of whatever label you decide so you have the freedom to change it. Even though I know you pay more for peace, still less money, and, you, and you're not lit sitting on all those labels, okay? So if you wanna go for bigger quantities on round two of your labels, go for it, all right? But just take, um, take it slow, okay? The company that I have used is called W&W, &W, which is W&W, and, w, and they're, um, I think they're in Illinois, and they're terrific with their customer service. They have all different kinds of labels and they'll send you a packet of options, okay? There's also another place called Fancy Weaver, um, for labels and they're www.fancyweaver.com slash label, I think it is. They have a 200 piece minimum, I think, which is small and it's terrific. There's also a good one called labeltex.com, L-A-B-E-L-T-E-X.com. So those three should get you started, okay? And um, again, just keep in mind, don't go too crazy in case you want to change your branding, depending on how things shake out and how your target market comes together once you're, you're launched, okay? So more tips, strategies, articles, videos at fashionbrainacademy.com. If you're not already getting our newsletter and getting these videos in your inbox every week, go sign up and we'll see you there. Thanks again. Have a great day.